hello and welcome to my youtube channel um this is i blessing up all right in this video i'm going to be showing you how to create a pos banner a printable pos banner um design with pixel lab with pixel lab all right so the first thing i'm going to do is to go to pixel lab so once you click on pixel lab this is the first thing you're going to be having on your screen but if you have the normal version you have something different but this is the um black mode version that's why i'm having this on my screen just click on it and delete it so the next thing i'm going to do is to um input my image size all right input my image size the image size for this design is 7902 okay so this is it so i'll go to the background and edit the color from black to white so the next thing i'm going to do is to import um the background that i want to add to this background so that it will not just be a normal plain background sorry i'm going to be importing it from my gallery sorry Okay, so once I import this from my gallery, this is what I'm going to have. So just click on 3 ratio 4. So we are working with click on 3 ratio 4 and then let it and spread it. Very nice. This is it. So once it's spread, just reduce the upper, just lock it, lock it and reduce the opacity to um let's use let's say eight. Alright, so once that is done. The next for in light studio is to import the images we will be using. First of all, let me bring the the logo design choice link. It's the logo for this design. Make sure it's at the center. Let me lock. Okay, so after that, the next is to make the right top POS. So I'm going to go to fonts to change the fonts. So font I'm using here is Tosca. Tosca 570. Increase the size. Increase the size. I'm not going to work on the color yet. Let's just do this. POS is available. So the next is to check. The next is deposit the draw and transform. Next set of text. Let me copy from it. So you can copy this. Deposit the draw and transform. Well, you can see that if I write it like this, the space, there are spaces, there are no spaces in between the lines. It's too, um, it's too jam packed. So what I'm gonna do? Let me add a little bit of space. A little bit of space. All right. Next is I'm going to get the um shape no, but before then let me import the images we are using from there we're gonna get the colors the colors and all so let me get the image okay. so let me get the POS image you can see how this is it's facing it's facing here but for the one in this place is facing the other side so what we're going to do is to go back to crop and click on this yeah you can see you can rotate this here so let me lock every other element of this
get other images start times and the start time image but I'm going to remove the background click on erase color to remove So next I'm going to is to bring up my shape Color to me. So I already have the color here. I'm not going to add the limit. Click on the first icon, click on the color picker, then choose from Go TV color. Say deep red. And that is the color that was used. So this is it. So the next now is to make the other right of sales of data and recharge cards. Uh, so I'm going to click on text, then make my right of. available go to your font again alright and work on the alignment let it to be left to be centered make sure it is centered can reduce the spacing the line spacing Let's lock this. Let's get the let's get a shape to just put I'll do it again. Yeah, it's height is 9 so I have 5 networks here mm -hmm. alright so I'm done with the alignment right now so next thing is to let's lock the network social networks and then the sales sales of data recharge and then I'm going to bring it up Then let's 
made the last right up. Other services include. Now this is let's start putting colors right now. This is white at the center. Other services include now uh, for the let's arrange or uh, just the go to TV and the rest. So now for the POS, the, the color for the POS, you can click on this edit option. Or let me just go straight. For POS, click on it and click on color. Choose the same color we, we got from Go TV. The GO, the red GO, is a deep, is a deep red. Let me unlock this. It's available as black. Here is black also. You can see the beauty is coming out now. Let me lock it the purest machine. So for the deposit and this thing, let's make a little bit of black for now. Right, let's work on the alignment of the this is the perfect center. Let me just lock them. Let me lock them for the network. Provide that logo. Let me lock them. Alright, like this. And then we bring them to the center. Click on basic position and click on this. It goes to the center. Now, for the size of that, that this thing, let me change the color to black. You can see the beauty is already out. It's coming out. Lock, lock, lock. We are done with all this. So you lock it. So you use this to just add the colors. The color for deposits withdraw is white. Alright, color for deposit and withdraw is white. Is white. Color for transfer is deep blue. Deep blue and deep blue is this is click on the transfer and click on plus icon go to your color picker go to dstv choose this this is you're not going to use any other color apart from the ones um, already from the ones already on your screen don't initiate any other color to be um, i'm going to be causing a color color right okay so the next is that time subscription which is black go to your dstv is white that time cost solution is also let me lock this also start time subscription is black go tv and dstv are white So the next thing I'm going to do is to import shapes. Shape that go with what we are doing. So the color for the shape for the draw deposit is green. Right, it's green, and the green is gotten from the yellow, from the glow logo. The glow, the lighter part of the that is where it was gotten. So let me move it to the back. You see that? Well, let me be. Alright, so before the next now, let me. I'm going to lock. Let me lock this. Now I'm working on the shapes. Now anything you're not working on, ensure to lock it so that to avoid your work being to avoid distracting your work. So we're going to copy the same shape. And bring it down to withdraw. The withdraw, color for withdraw is the same red. The same red we have been using the deep red.
So these are the these are all of it well arranged and all. So let me just work on this. So the end of the design. I hope you learned a lot watching this. So once you are done with it, like I've done right now, you're gonna click on this option, then save as image. Save and for it to be printable or printed. I guess they like the printers like having it in PNG because it's smaller in PNG as PNG. When your image format is in PNG, it's smaller. Then change, make sure it is the dimension is ultra. Then you save it to your calendar. Hope to see you in the next video. And please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel if you have not, and. Um, Click on the notification bell to keep receiving more updates from us and then comment, comment, just say your mind, just say your mind, what do you think about the video, say your mind. Thank you for watching once again, hoping to see you in the next video, bye for now, bye.